I thought I would show everybody how I cut the cubes that I use to make the, the puzzle cubes. Uh, every student needs 27 cubes and with about 75 students that's a lot of cubes to cut. So the first thing I do is make a bunch of square stock by just cutting them a little bit big and then sending them through the planer. And then I have this set up. What you do is you clamp a piece of wood to the fence so that as the blocks are going through they're not going to get trapped. Okay, then I have this miter gauge here. I added a piece of wood to it to keep everything nice. And that's kind of where the blade goes through. And it works really well. Um, I, I'm going to use this method to cut the, the wood blocks for the dice to make for the, uh, the new game box. Where There's uh, another game called 32 Dice that I'm going to add to the, to the game box later. And it's going to be fun. So I'll show that too in another video. But this is how I cut the blocks. And this method is actually really accurate. I can get within a couple thousandths of an inch on all the cubes. They're, they're really, really close to each other, so I don't get a lot of variation. So what I do is I find the, uh, the edge that sits the flattest, because sometimes wood can warp. And so, and I'll line it up right with the cut here. I'll trim off the end so it's nice and square, and then I just keep cutting. I'll just do this stick and I'll speed it up so if you want to sit through the whole thing. I got a little bit more work cut out for me, but uh, it's worth it. Um, and I like having fun projects for my students to work on. If any of you out there know of a faster way of doing this, please let me know, make a response video, and I will give it a try. Thank you.